hi guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is Hannah Renee and it is so nice to meet you today we're gonna be doing a life update because I recently posted something on my Instagram if you don't follow me on Instagram you should it's Hannah Renee banana you should follow me there I just posted something that some pretty big news so I'm gonna be talking about that and just some other things that are going on in my life so without further ado let's just jump right on into this video so the big news is I'm moving to Tennessee and I'm so excited about it that's what I posted on my Instagram is just the news that my entire family and Alec are going to be moving to Tennessee. So I'm just going to be talking about that a little bit, just sharing my thoughts, what the Lord has been telling all of us and all of those things. This first thing though, I'm going to get out of the way and just talk about it, but I did dye my hair silver and there was a few videos where you could definitely see the silver, but it faded in a week. So I'm probably going to dye it again when I get paid. I'm going to dye it professionally this time though because I dyed it with a box last time. I don't suggest doing that, but I thought it would work and it didn't. So that's the little thing that I'm going to get out of the way other than talking about moving. But just so you know, that happened and it's happening again. <laughs> my decision to move because it was my decision my parents let me decide my decision about moving was very hard for the first two weeks honestly but then just after those two weeks the lord just started preparing my heart just started shifting things inside of me and it just made it so much easier and it made it make so much more sense to me because I've moved 13 times, this is number 13, and I hate moving when I see that there's no point to it. When I see that there's so much value in moving, then I really appreciate it, and this is something that I really see a lot of value in doing. One of the things that the Lord really spoke to me personally about moving is just that this next season of my life is going to be where the Lord grants the desires of my heart. Not that this past season, being a youth pastor, going to Bible college, not that any of that was bad at all. I definitely cherish this last season. I've grown so much in this last season and I've loved it. But I think that this next season, the Lord is just going to grant some things that I've always wanted to do, but I never had the opportunity to. And some of those things are like getting a real job where you have shifts and everything and I'm planning on going to work at an Ulta over in Tennessee just because that would be my dream to talk about makeup and just work with makeup and all of those things that would just be amazing to me so that's my dream I hope that it works out Lord willing that I can get a real job at an Ulta. Some of the other things have to do with college because the school that I did go to was mostly for people that were already in ministry so it wasn't necessarily all my age group which isn't a bad thing. I really love the people at the school that I went to but I really have always wanted to go to a school with people that are my age and I've always wanted to live in dorms but it just was never possible because I had to be close to the church being that was my job. So I'm excited for this next season and what the Lord's going to do for me because these are things that I've always wanted to do but I've never been able to. Somebody asked what I'm least excited about and definitely would be the weather. The weather I hear is very humid in the summer and that just sounds like a nightmare to me but other than that I think it'll be okay. A lot of people were asking what Alec is going to do as far as moving because we're not married. So what he's going to do is hopefully my family will be able to get a house with an in-law quarters with it. So it's the main house with an extra small house on the same property so that he could live in the house. That's what we're hoping for. If that doesn't work, he'll most likely move in with my grandparents. We're hoping that we can find a house with some in-law quarters with it. But other than that, people have been asking a lot about 
me and Alec getting married and all of that, which I haven't really talked about on my channel ever, but our original timeline for when we wanted to get married has definitely changed now because of the move and everything, especially because he really wants to get settled in this new community with a job and maybe his own place if he's able to move out and, you know, do all that. But I also want to live in dorms and experience like a real college life, like student life and that type of thing. So it's definitely being pushed back. I don't really know when it's gonna happen, but it'll happen eventually, I promise. The last thing and the biggest thing that people are wondering about is the church that we are leaving behind, which is the church that my parents are the senior pastors at and the church that Alec and I are the youth pastors at. So since we're both leaving, there's a lot of gaps that need to be filled, but we're currently praying and searching for people to fill in those spots. But whoever does take over either position, I'm assuming, and most likely this will happen, that they will be mentored by my dad and by Alec so that they're set up for success. But we are still searching. We have no idea. We also are going to be planting our own church in Tennessee as well. So that's super cool. But we're going to be planting a church there and it will happen eventually. Not immediately though because we want to get, you know, settled and established in a new community. So that is coming in the future. But as of right now for the next couple months because I'm moving in June. So for the next couple months, I'm really just focusing a lot on social media and on finishing my job at the church well and just all of that. I have been working on social media a lot, pre-filming and taking pictures and all that stuff just to get content. So I'm putting a lot of effort into this right now, but I'm excited for this new season. I'm sure I'll be a little bit more nervous and scared when it comes, but Right now, I'm just really excited and anticipating for great things to happen, but that's what I wanted to talk to you guys about to just give you a little bit of a life update that I'm not going to be in California much longer. So that's the end of this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and let me know of any other questions, anything that you have on your mind that you'd like me to answer about this whole move and everything, because I'd love to answer those for you and, you know, help out your worries and concerns and questions and all that. That's it. I will see you guys next Wednesday. Bye, guys!